I'm Josh, and he's Job, and we are Ristry Ofs and Revise. So, we are looking at a really nice knife. Well, it's not nice. It's our grandfather's knife again. And it's got a... Uh, it's got a... Joe Phyllis, would you say it's gator or leather or plastic or silicone? That is plastic. Okay. Yeah, that's... Let's see, it's, pre it's preserved. It is a Japan-made knife. Don't know what it is. But let's open this up, and Job's going to tell you some details about it. There's nothing really to differentiate it um, from anything else because it's only a single blade. So look at the luster of it. Oh, God. Oh, a, my God. Disco ball. It's got a bunch of scratches on the blade. Um, he uses for skinning, I believe. It's the original Bowie knife is what it's called. And it's by Globe Master, number 64 out of 700 and... No. Number 64 out of 1,470 made in Japan. So, tell me about it, Job. Details. Sorry about that. Um, well, it's got some weird material on the handle. I don't know what it is. It's like plastic to me. Yeah, it's like plastic. Uh, Would you trust it? You know, um, I don't know. I'm. It looks cool, but I don't know how to feel about it. it it's got the screws. Got It looks like wood, this handle and it's got the I, I do like that little handle that hand guard and the blade is kind of matte it doesn't really have a whole it not not matte as in like the shine the matte is in like the design there's no like real like those curves that most have on the metal or designs like that it's i don't know this it feels very flimsy to me i don't really i'm yeah this is weird i don't know how to feel about this i feel like this would split down the seam mm. or if you hit it too hard or something I don't know how to so feel. So you wouldn't recommend it? Uh, for whatever, like hunting or cutting or doing other stuff with, I really don't think I'd recommend this. I mean, it looks cool. Like, I mean, really, it looks cool. Like, the handle looks like to be made of high quality, but it's like plastic. Like, it, it feels like a toy, and this is real. Um, I respect it for what it is and the origin, but I do not, I'm not a fan of this. At, like, really, like, I, I don't know. It's just... It's cool to look at, and it has, it does have a nice, it does have a nice feel when you hold it like this, like you gangster. But we, when you hold it like this, it doesn't feel reliable. It feels like it'd break at any moment. Like it, I don't know. But it does have a beautiful luster. That blade luster is like a crap ton. I believe Grandma or David, someone uh, that you guys don't know, said that this was. Um, I think he bought it for. Twenty-four dollars and something oh, wow. seventy-five, twenty-four seventy-five, and this was like um, I believe they said twenty-two, twenty-three years ago. At the time I got it, so it could be much older. Yeah. If anyone anyone knows the exact year of this, I told you it's a Globe Master um, brand. And if you want to like get up close on it, because I know I if we can get the focus on it before we run out of time, we we're running out of time on the SD card, and I think we're gonna run out by the time it focus. There we go. That's what it looks like right there, the the wood fake wood looking handle. I'm whatever. We're we're done. Job says he doesn't recommend it, so listen to him, goddammit. 